you please introduce yourself and uh, tell us who you are and what do you do in a daily living? Sure. Uh, my name is Sadhvi Adichananda Saraswati and I'm from Ganga Action Pariwar in India. Uh, we're working with the people of the world and people of every faith, every background, to ensure that there's water left for this world and that there's an environment left for this world. Uh, right now we're at a serious tipping point where the decisions we make right now can either keep us alive or kill us. Not just me and you, but the entire world. The water is drying up. Because of that, vegetation is drying up. And because of that, people are dying. We can't allow that to happen. And that's our mission, is to enable people to live by enabling the resources to survive. Thank you very much for that. Um, today, you, you are in the discussions about post-2015 Agenda for yes. Water. What is your main message? What is your main message in, this, in these discussions? The main message is water is a ethical dilemma. It's all about ethics and morals. We can either make the right choices or the wrong choices. The right choices are separating sewage from our drinking water. The wrong choices are doing things that take away the drinking water from the people or pollute our drinking water. Uh, we're here as spiritual people to bring these messages to everybody that uh, policies are people. The policies that are being set right now affect the world and affect our lives. So we need to make the right choices so that the right choices can even be made, any choices can be made in the future, because there is a future. Really what it comes down to is people need to examine how will the future remember me? We, our, our human lives are very short. Um, in your work, uh, Yes. It, it is a practical action work? Yes. Um, Ganga Action Pariwar has many programs. For example, we're supplying thousands of toilets up and down the river Ganga because 70% of the people in India's rural areas don't even have a toilet. 20, I'm sorry, 2 billion liters of sewage is going into the Ganga every day. And this is the same river that supports the life of 500 million people. That's more than the Netherlands, USA, and Russia combined. But yet, the choices that are being made are causing people to die. Uh, so we're putting toilets. We're also planting trees uh, to enable the ecosystem to survive. Uh, we're working on working with endangered species, preserving the endangered species, and also providing clean water to the people. And at the same time, we're working here, places like this, on the policy level, to ensure that the policies that are set are the policies that preserve life and enable us to have a beautiful world again, like we all deserve. Thank you so much for this interview, and uh, I wish you a pleasant stay in the Netherlands.